Hi, I'm Elise from The Munch Bunch. You may see The Munch Bunch around at your local parks or your neighbor's house, eating buckthorn and other invasive plants. Last year we received a Sustainable Agriculture Research and Education Grant to study virtual fence collars for goats. So normally if we're setting up this fence, it can be difficult to fence certain areas, especially when you're talking about going through the woods. And so this product was invented in the 70s and really hasn't changed. I don't know what, whose idea it was to take basically a giant fish net and walk through the woods because it's really, it's, it's super easy work. I, almost, almost anyone can do it. And uh, uh But as you can see, we are not using a fence around these goats. We're actually using this new collar system from No Fence, and it's a virtual fence system. All I have to do is pull out my phone, open up a, the app, see the map of where I wanna put the goats, and then I just draw the map of where the goats should hang out, and then that provides the zone of containment for where the goat should be. So if this guy gets near the boundary, he's gonna hear a warning noise and that's gonna tell him to turn around. He'll actually instinctively turn his head and walk the other way. If he were to ignore the noise, he would eventually get an electric shock, the same exact voltage as the current technology with the net fencing. In the past, there were some terrains that we couldn't really do with fencing, with the available fencing that we had. Now, we feel like we can do any site, anywhere with this technology. This can be used for cattle and sheep and all sorts of production systems. And we can put animals back on the land for regenerative agriculture, managed grazing, carbon sequestration, and all sorts of things. So if you see these goats wandering around and you don't see a fence, they're actually contained by virtual fencing. If you want to learn more about the Munch Bunch or our virtual fencing project, you can visit us at munchbunchgoats.com. I am the most loved individual by goats.